This is Module 5, Lesson 20, Homework. Today's objective was to recognize and show that equivalent fractions have the same size, though not necessarily the same shape. Number 1. Label the shaded fraction. Draw two different representations of the same fractional amount. When I look at this fraction, I see that there are three parts that are shaded. To find the denominator, I need to count all the equal parts. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven equal parts. This fraction is three-sevenths shaded. I need to draw two more ways to show three-sevenths. One way I could do that is in a long, skinny rectangle. And I can partition that into seven equal parts by drawing six lines. Then I can shade three of those parts to show three sevenths. On your own, draw another picture. Another good way to do this is as a rectangle broken into seven equal parts. Complete that rectangle by breaking it into seven equal parts and then shading three sevenths. Number two, these two shapes both show four fifths. So this first shape has four parts shaded and five parts total. The second shape has four parts shaded and five parts total. Are the shapes equivalent? Why or why not? Both of these shapes show four fifths. So, yes, they are equivalent because they both show four fifths. The shapes might be different, but they are both showing four parts shaded and five equal parts. Letter B. Draw two different representations of four fifths that are equivalent. So another example, we could draw a long skinny rectangle partitioned into fifths. And then I would shade four fifths. I can also do that as a square making lines across and shading four of those sections. Number three, D Diana ran a quarter mile straight down the street. Becky ran a quarter mile on a track. Who ran more? Explain your thinking. Diana ran a quarter. A quarter is the same fraction as one fourth. Becky ran a quarter. The quarter is the same fraction as one fourth. When I look at these two fractions, they are the same. So they ran the same amount. The way they ran was different because Be or Diana ran in a straight line and Becky ran in a circle but they both ran the same amount so they ran equivalent fractions. <laughs>